We're in the stand. It's about my ninth attempt to sit. I think it's my ninth. But we're here in a place that we've been getting this pretty good buck. He's a pretty good nine pointer. He's been by this camera like four times. And he comes here pretty consistently. It's a little windy out, as you can see. And you can probably hear it too. But they just cut the cornfield over here. And I think that's gonna make a big difference in these deer coming. So we'll see what we can get tonight.
มาว่าเราไม่รู้แต่เขาใหญ่ผมรัดเขาออกมาและฉันได้ทั้งหมดในวิดีโอไม่รู้แต่มันคือผู้หญิงใหญ่เขาจากโอ้โหเขาเป็นผู้หญิงใหญ่เขาเป็นผู้หญิงใหญ่เขาเป็นผู้หญิงใหญ่เขาเป็นผู้หญิงใหญ่เขาเป็นผู้หญิง Here, I'll check for you. Oh my gosh! How didn't we get him on camera? But holy crap! I mean, let's go. All right. So um, I'm gonna get down. All right, you can call me back. Holy crap! Okay, okay. All right. That was the weirdest thing that happened. Holy crap! So, I actually just had like 20 minutes ago. I had it must have been a doe or something beneath me, but she blew. She must have winded me, and I waited for like 20 minutes, and then rattled, rattled with my little four or eight point set and. In about two minutes, I look over here, look back over, straight across from me, where we got another stand, and I just see a big old eight point just staring over here. He definitely was coming up to the rattle, but I I think I drilled him, and he should be down. But oh my gosh, that was awesome. That's my first ever shot at a buck with the bow. Let's go. So I'm gonna get down, go check the arrow, cause I think the arrow, he was like 25 yards and he was going up into the cornfield. And I was just talking about how I'm guessing something was gonna use that trail because they just picked the cornfield. But holy crap, that's awesome. I have shaken so bad right now, but I gotta get down so. I don't fly to the tree. <laughs> All right, guys. I just got down from the tree. Now I'm gonna go see the check the arrow. He was at like 25 yards. Just a little bit with 
it. Holy crap, yeah. I'm already getting really good blood. Right here. Oh, yeah. That looks like a hard shot. The blood. Or the air is filled with blood. I see bubbles 100%. Heart shot. That thing's gotta be down just right up here. Everything looks good. Arrows covered in blood. It looks to be from. Oh yeah, I think it's got to be done. Holy crap! That thing has got to be done. Right around here, and right away, blood. So it's awesome. That buck has got to be down. Holy crap, guys! This this is my first ever time shooting, holding back and trying to shoot a good buck. And I've sat, this is my ninth sit of the year. I've hung like eight tree stands for the last few months. And I've really been going at it. And I, this is just awesome. This is the first time I've been passing little bucks passing does and we're waiting for one that I think is big enough for me to shoot for my first ever buck. I know we've seen bigger deer than this one in here, but I've never seen this buck. And he, he's got like, looks to be like a crab claw on his left side. So this is amazing. I think he's gotta be down. He's probably down right now, but I'm gonna wait a little bit. I'm gonna call my dad and kind of talk to him for a little bit. So, I'll catch back in with you in a little bit and hopefully we can go in and try to find him here in an hour or two or something. I don't know yet. All right. I'm not seeing right here, but there's also. Oh, here's still a lot right there. Some right there. Holy crap, there's a decent little buck right there. Not even close to as big as the one. But he has no clue that I'm right here. The doe sees him now. But. Jeez, the buck still has no clue. Oh, yeah, now he looks. I mean, he's just staring at me. Yeah, I just saw it. I got a... Oh, I see him. Yeah. That buck was right on him. Oh, really? Yeah. Is he in the field or on the edge? Yeah, he's on the field. Holy oh, yeah. Oh shoot, there's a doe right there. Oh frick. There's a blind. Like a wood one? No, like an actual blind. I gotcha. In the corner or in the field? In the, right in the edge of the field. You think I'm good to go over there? Well, you will get a dead deer. I mean, it's probably... I mean, it's, the windows are not open in it. I'm literally like 40 yards from this dome. She has no clue that I'm here. I haven't even showed the GoPro yet. Alright. 
see that. Uh, like, right there. Like a hundred yards? Not even. Oh, geez, there's a little doe right there. I mean, these deer just do not care. Oh, there's the buck right there chasing him. <laughs> these, de these deer don't care. Yeah, I told you once they cut it, it was, it was going to be like night day difference. Oh, shoot, there's geese there. Yeah. Looky there. I mean, it was, it definitely rolled over because it's on a slant. But you can right. tell that I, I can definitely see bubbles. So I know it at least got long. But if it died right here, it's got to be heart shot. Yeah, yo, that's a good. That's a good. It's either, you probably got it with the lungs. That's awesome. Yeah. Holy crap. All right. You, you wanna. Ran like 100 yards, 120 yards. Oh boy, there's some geese coming into this field. But look at this bad boy. Big ol' eight. He's got some tall frickin' tines. Exactly what I thought he was. Just a big tall eight point. Definitely can't see the blood. But yeah. I hard shot him. So that is my first ever buck with the bow and I've been practicing I just bought my own bow spent a lot of money on this because spent a lot on the bow got a lot of arrows got some rod heads and I was waiting for a time like this for a good buck to make its way within range and I made the perfect shot Let's go. Jeez. Shot deer with uh, muzzle loaders. Just, that's pretty much it, is muzzle loaders. And, holy crap, the bow is just a lot different. It's definitely a lot harder. You gotta get them in range. But, now that I got the bow buck down, it's time to hopefully get some, get into gun season shoot another big buck like that but let's go that's awesome i'm so excited so i hope you guys like the video and please do a like and subscribe and we'll see you on the next one see you